All right, guys, hole number three is a par five. <clears throat> I think we're going to go APOC five and 20% combined with the Kingmaker. And actually, we don't even need that, so we are not going to do that shot. Guys, we are going to make this way easier on ourselves. QB10. Paired with the sniper. Full top. And probably four left spin. Yeah, that'll work. And then all I'm doing is looking down this line right here. For my land zone and then i'll do about a quarter ball curl might have needed a little more curl with that nope that's fine oh i thought it was going to be good <clears throat> so you can either go <coughs> a little more curl or um a little more side spin but QB 10 at max power max distance basically almost up against that rough's edge on the left where kind of where he's at is the perfect perfect land zone I landed in the center of the fairway Maybe a little left center with my bad uh, uh, mishit. <clears throat> and this is probably going to fly the fairway and catch the rough. So he, he flew, too, he hit it too far. All right, if you get into this position, you can possibly get away with it oh yeah you can easily get away with this shot <clears throat> all you gotta do is catch perfect ball the great is gonna catch that bunker nope <clears throat> So we got the perfect wind for this hole if you accidentally uh, end up in that rough. <clears throat> As you can see, we still easily got it there with the uh, full overpower um, rough iron. But like I was saying guys, QB 10 off the tee box. Uh, paired with a uh, a Titan ball or or a uh, Kingmaker, you should be able to go to max distance with the, either either of those. And then uh, I used four right spin. You might want to use five or just a slight bit more curl uh, than what I did. Or don't don't miss hit uh, left. <clears throat> All right, good luck with that hole, guys.